let's talk about nuptial flights. Nuptial flights are a very important behavior in some social insects, largely in ants and termites, but also occasionally in some species of bees and flies. However, for this video, we're going to be talking about it mainly in the context of ants. A nuptial flight is a usually annual behavior that is seen in some social insect, and it is very, very important for reproduction and the founding of new colonies. So normally in things like ant colonies, there is one reproductive individual, the queen, or in some species, gammergate, who is responsible for all of the reproduction of the entire colony. However, once a year, the colony will produce other reproductive individuals called allates. These allates are males and virgin reproductive females who are not yet queens. These allates are the only individuals of the colony who have wings and are capable of flight. This larger one over here is the female allate or future queen, and these smaller ones are males. Now, nuptial flights all happen at the same time every year, for all colonies of a species. Now, different species of ants and termites and what have you will have their nuptial flights at different points of the year, but for the same species, all allate individuals from all colonies will emerge at the same time to begin their flight. What happens is that the winged individuals will take flight and disperse throughout the entire area in order to mate with unrelated individuals from different colonies. Now, the male allates, their only purpose in life is to mate with a female. Once that task is accomplished, they pretty much die immediately. However, the female, and I'm pretty sure this one is a female, but if it's not, oops, um, the female, she will then go find a suitable nesting place and start laying eggs in order to found a new colony. During this time, she also will lose her wings, whether they just fall off naturally or she rips them off herself and becomes once again flightless. Then she will lay her eggs and raise the first generations of new workers for this brand new colony. The queen will then continue to lay multiple more clutches of eggs all throughout her life, and every year, some of those eggs will develop into allies, and the whole circle of life and system will start again. 